Jordan Lewis has had a solid career at the University of Michigan, and now in his third year with the program, he's emerged as one of the top cornerbacks in all of college football. This was the guy we had ranked as the number 131 player in the class of 2013, the number 10 cornerback prospect in that class, and he comes out of that defensive back factory at Detroit Cass Technical School. They've put a lot of guys at the Division One level, and, and Lewis, honestly, with the, the track his career's going right now, could emerge as being the most productive from that group. we got a ton of chances to see Jordan Lewis throughout his high school career because this is a guy that loved to compete. He was on every camp, every combine he could make it to to showcase his skill set and to improve his game, and he always was a fun one to watch. Excellent change of direction, great top end speed, uh, but what really made him stand out was he had those intangibles at knack for knowing where the football is in the air, for being able to uh, anticipate wide receivers routes, and, and he was always around the football, a very tough guy to get separation on, even when we saw him you know, at, at events like the Five Star Challenge. Um, you know, which was the top 100 players in the country, or the Army Bowl, which again, top players in the country. Jordan Lewis was able to match up those top guys and lock them down. The knock on Lewis was even towards the end of his senior year, he was only 5'10", 159 pounds, very small. A uh, small framed guy, wasn't going to put on a lot of weight. But this speaks to something I've been preaching for a long time. College coaches are so enamored with these tall, lengthy cornerbacks but the truth is, you know, the what most important attributes at the cornerback position are hips and top end speed. And that's why you see in the in the in the NFL, the majority of, of cornerbacks are not six one and six two. The majority are under six foot tall because that length is not valuable unless you have the hips and the and the speed to run with wide receivers down the field. Jordan Lewis has that. And that's what's making him uh, into one of the top cornerbacks in the country and surely going to be one of the top cornerback prospects when he enters the NFL draft.